beer people. What's up, y'all? Brewski Brothers here today. Ooh. We got us a beer review. Yes. It's been a while. It we has. decided it's, uh, it's been long overdue. It's way overdue. So we decided to get something uh, seasonal. Merry <laughs> Christmas. There you go. And That's kind of sacrilegious. Right? So. Well, it's alright, though. <laughs> uh, we're looking at Shiner. Shiner. Shiner Holiday Cheer. Every drop of Shiner is brewed in Shiner. Texas. Texas. <laughs> <laughs> they show me a burger. There you go. It's ale brewed with peaches, <laughs> pecans, and with natural flavor and caramel color. It's a Bavarian style dark wheat. Hmm, nice. It's basically a Dunkelweizen. Yeah, essentially. exactly. Um, it says, We hope you enjoy Shiner Beer, an old world Dunkelweizen brewed with Texas peaches and roasted pecans. The multi flavors of the dark wheat ale enhanced through the use of malted barley and wheat. And Krausing. And Krausing? And Krausen ensures the like smoothness that makes the subtle peach and pecan. I'm excited about peach and pecan. I did not expect that would be the flavor. And hopefully, uh, I don't know. This is to you from Shiner. Yeah, man. Let's see so, what. Um, let's, let's give it a shot. That's what it says. To you from yeah, Shiner. No, it's exactly. a gift. Because it's a gift. It is a gift. It is a gift. And we're gonna use these lovely uh, pint glasses. My gift is a curse. Thank you for Christmas. Mm. Oh, speaking of Christmas, yeah. yeah. Let's pour it up. Hmm. See, with Dunkelweizen, and I expect a, maybe it's just me, but I expect a little bit of the banana kind of clovey flavor. I expect um, a really good head. You got better head than I got. It smells like butthole. Off the first it's, wave. Well, it, it, it smells, smells like, like a dunghole. But, but it smells like a, it has a little holiday cheer to the smell. It smells like a dunghole. I smell dunghole. the peaches. Really? I smell the peaches. Yeah. Moving to the country. Do you smell the peaches? Eat a lot of peaches. Peaches for me? Mm uh hmm. -huh. I yes, I do, peaches. actually. Yes, I smell nothing yes. but peaches, actually. I smell it. I, that's so weird. I don't combine them with peach. That's because they squeezed it. I'm excited. Yeah. Man, let's try it. You see, we got our Brewster Brothers peach. pint glasses. Yeah. If anybody's interested in any Brewster Brothers pint glasses, for the record. They're not packed in sale. No. Yeah, available. We will be. Yeah, we will. <laughs> we actually will be having these, guys. You know, they're going to be like 10 bucks, probably. I think yeah. they'd be pretty fucking kick ass. Yeah, they look anyway. pretty sexy, says Brewster Brothers, obviously. Back to the beer. Anyway, let's try this. It tastes like Christmas, but it does. It tastes like peaches, though. It does. I it, can't get peaches out of my head. It's I think it's a power suggestion. No, maybe. All right. How about this? It almost reminds me of like a slightly. Um, Weaker version of Son of a Peach. That's exactly what I thought. Yeah. R.J. Walker, Son of a Peach. Yes. I hate to say it, guys. Anybody local that can get R.J. Walker's. Seriously, get it. Get this. It has so much peach flavor. It tastes like Son of a Peach. Yeah. I'm just, I don't mind. I don't mind, but Christmas, I don't know. Yeah, I don't think a peach. Shiner, you kind of <laughs> fucked up hitting Christmas. You, um, miss, you miss Christmas. I don't, to me, it doesn't taste like Christmas. I mean, it should taste like... It tastes festive. Yeah. But Christmas festive, I don't know. I was thinking it should taste like... Holly berries. Yeah. It kind of tastes like that. They didn't tell me it was peaches and told me it was <laughs> holly berries, maybe. Yeah. What the <laughs> holly berries? I don't know. I don't know. Everybody wants to That's what they have on there. Isn't that? Aren't those little holly berries? Yeah. Yeah. Better holly than, berries. Better, better than dingleberries. So. Yeah. That's pretty. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Overall, though, I don't taste the pecan, really. No. Maybe on the back side, because it, it gets a little body from it. It's peachy from beginning to end. But it's peachy as a motherfucker. And it has a... Uh, uh, if you um, like peaches, try it. Yeah, please. Seriously, though, if, you, if you've had R.J. Walker's Son of a Peach... It is good. I'm not going to lie. I, I'm now enjoying it. It's, it's not unenjoyable. I would give this beer to, like, almost anybody. Yeah. Not almost anybody. Like, the average beer drinker would enjoy this. I, I feel like. Yeah. I think for Christmas, people would enjoy this. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know, man. It's up to debate. How about it's like how about fall. how about you guys get it and tell us, all right? So we're it's calling, like a Christmas peach. Yeah, we're calling on our pint Templar friends. Yes, there you go. Calling on you. Try Check it. it. Try it out. Let us know what you think. Do you for think it's, it's appropriate for, for Christmas? Appropriate for Christmas? I, think so. I don't know. And that should be the title of this video. Yeah. Appropriate for Christmas? I think it should say at the bottom like question mark. <clears throat> no. Jesus Christ approves of this beer. I don't think you would. No. But maybe because it tastes like wine. But there you have it, man. If I'm gonna give it a, a from a one to uh, ten, one to ten on what though? Are we doing dunkles? Are we doing Christmas? Dunkle vice one to uh, ten, like a fucking three, because it doesn't taste like right. dunkle vice to me. Um, for a Christmas beer, probably a fucking three, because it doesn't taste like Christmas to me neither. I need gingerbread. Really? Um, I'm giving weird. this a three, but I, but drinkability, I'll give it like a seven. Yeah. I could drink it, but I would never buy one it. One to ten to Christmas, I give it a six. 
It's slightly tingling my butthole, like for Christmas. But that's not enough, man. But you, gotta, you gotta. That's why it's six out of ten. You know. You gotta get in there. But for drinkability, yes, I would give it an eight for drinkability. Yeah. But I would never buy it again. Well, this would be the only time I buy this beer. In my well, life. we still have four more. That's why I will drink the rest of them, but I won't buy them again. <laughs> so there you have it. Uh, I'll buy it next try. year. I'm not gonna lie to you. He'll buy it next I'll year. I'll buy it again next year. So give it a shot. Let us know what you think. If you've had Son of a Peach, tell us if you think it's a uh, little brother of such. It is. It's very gassy. I feel a lot of mm -hmm. burps coming on. So um, there you have it, man. So maybe you learn something. Maybe you won't.